with I mean, doing me. with doing Billy Bishop with the farm show with the oil show with seeds all these things are about history and about Canadian history do you think that the artist the actor the performers the the directors in Canada have a responsibility <coughs> to that history or that we tell it in a unique way or that we tell history or we put history on the palette so to speak in a way that needs to be there for the country. I wouldn't use the word history because in my mind history is a different occupation and a different pursuit than right. theater. I mean you can have historical stuff in it but it's a different pursuit. History is something else. I'm, what I think though is the continuing conversation that artists have and it's a continuing one has to do with identity. Who we are, how we do it. And it's not branding. It's not that. And it's not, and it's never static. It's always, it's ongoing, and it's a rolling, ongoing conversation. And as to go back to you and your five stories, I as a Canadian, how do I encounter, at this point in my life, these five stories as Canadians? And, and but that is never fixed. It's always going. And it's what, and it's, it, because it helps us in the general conversation, helps. It's essential in the, in the conversation of a country to actually know who you are in some way. And again, we're just adding to the conversation. The conversation can be made in different ways, but it's about us. And it's about our experience of being us now, at this moment, which will be different when we tell it tomorrow or the next day. And that conversation is so important because unless you know who you are, you can't make decisions about what you're going to do. And that's one reason I think that Canada has floundered, especially in English Canada, that we, we have this constant sense we'll grow up, we'll become older in a sense. We don't work out of actually facing who we are in an ongoing conversation and therefore can make better decisions about what we should be doing. You mean we don't do those conversations in the theater or in television? Well, or in oh, film yeah, well, or in media yeah, or in we do them. Well, or? we do them. We do them different places. I mean, I mean, it has to happen in all those places. It has to happen in all our art forms. It should be happening in our politics. It should be happening in our histories and in our education system. Of, you know, again, it's all the conversation is made up of all our voices in all the forms that we care to talk about. But in a colonial place, you don't talk about that. In fact, you go your way not to talk about it. You want to talk about them and the special place. And again, I think, and again, so it's, and again, I mean, we could talk about that. We are talking about a Canadian reality by actually talking about how fucked up we are, in a sense, or colonial we are. That becomes part of it, or it becomes part of the story about who we are. When I, if we were to do a play about a Canadian film producer, a television producer who wants to make the greatest, he wants to make Breaking Bad. Why can't we make Breaking Bad in this country? You know, because that's a reality. Of, now, <laughs> I have lots of reasons to say we could. It won't be Breaking Bad. You mean why can't you say why can't we make good no theater in this country? You know, like some other cultural model. I, I mean, you can make something Canadian that's wonderful and excellent in television. And if you want to take Breaking Bad as something wonderful and excellent in American television, and then you could have, this is our excellent one, this is your excellent one, but they're not going to be the same. Yeah. And nor should you think that that excellent one is the only excellent one there is to make. I mean, that's their business. Yeah.